Uh, hello, hello, guys. Uh, here we have uh, an Acer uh, laptop. There's no power. Let's check the battery. Okay, the battery is connected, but it's not turning on. Let me remove this. Let me remove the battery. Uh, okay. Let's see. Turn it on like oh, okay. Anyway, there's no battery. So what do we need here? Let's come with a power supply. Uh, okay. These are my power supply uh, cables. Now we need a pin for this charger. I have the pin here. Uh, which one to use? I don't know. Let me try this one. Let's see. Okay, I think this one is gonna be okay. All right. Uh, so we come with uh, 19 volt. Connect it here on the pin. We connect one probe to ground. Let me inject some power. Let's turn the laptop on. And the PC is turning on. Uh, we do have a display and the hard drive is 40 as you can see the machine is turning on and it's working 100 percent but the hard drive is 40 here uh, i'm not sure if you can hear the beeping sound i hope you can hear okay there's a clicking sound it's turning on and as you can see it's stuck here on the boot logo okay the PC is turning on and it's stuck here on the boot logo because of the corrupted hard drive the hard drive is dead okay let me show it to you again it's in on the PC the PC is turning on so the hard drive is not in on I think it's the hard drive or is it the hard drive or is the DVD ROM? But it's sounding more like an like a hard drive. Okay, I know let's go ahead, let's check. What is it? So this PC is came as a dead PC, meaning they were wrong PC. The PC is working, but there's a problem here. Oh yeah, the hard drive. I think it's the hard drive. Uh, that is faulty. Let's remove. Uh, let's try to remove a DVD ROM. Make it quick. Uh, by removing the, uh, by removing this tool, there should be one screw here for for a DVD ROM. I don't know which one is which, so let's try. I'm removing uh, both of them. Let's remove the other one. Okay, out. Uh, use a apply tool to remove the DVD ROM, and this is how you, you remove the DVD ROM. And coming out and it's not coming out let's try again okay it's not coming out oh wait but we know that this PC is working but there is a problem with the hard drive or with the DVD ROM, but it's more like a hard drive because it freezes. So, if a PC has a corrupted hard drive or dead hard drive, it should be very slow, extremely slow, and make this tick tick sound. So, there you need to remove the hard drive if you are having a problem with the hard drive. But this one this came here saying uh, to be fixed, but there's nothing to be fixed, it's working. I'm just gonna return it back to a guy because he's a, uh, an IT guy as well. 
Uh, so this to him is more like a basic stuff to be able to change the hard drive if it's the hard drive but you will see anyway there's nothing to learn here guys uh, sharp sharp 